Hi, my name is Jorgos Fufas. I run sales and partnerships at Exeger. We have had a fantastic week here at CES. Uh, and I would like to give all of you who missed this show a chance to take a tour. Follow me. So as you can, you can see, we have one of the largest booths here in the Venetian Hall. We are launching four new products here at CES and we already have seven products on the market. So let's take a look at the first one. This is one of the products that we're launching here at CES this week. It's a 3M Peltor hearing protector. This is one of the most premium hearing protectors that 3M has made. So this is top of the line. You see our solar cell here, our brand on the product. And this is a product that 3M is selling B2B. So directly to distributors and and to large construction companies. Most of 3M's here in protectors have non-rechargeable batteries. This one has a solar cell and a rechargeable battery. I dare to say that no other solar cell in the world will survive in, a, in this headband. It's a product that you use eight, nine, 10 hours a day and the product lifetime is around five years. So very, very tough conditions. If we survive in this product, we will survive in any headphone, any speaker and any helmet. Follow me to see the next one. I'm sure all of you know Philips, well-known brand. Here at CES, we're now launching uh, a new Philips headphone. It's a sporty type of headphone that will be for sales later this year. Philips is actually not only launching this one at the show, but they're also launching a second product. Here you see a Philips TV remote. This is the first remote control in the world with powerful that will have sales start later this year. You see the, the solar cell is completely integrated into the remote control, and you can see our brand visible on the product. This remote control will, in a normal indoor illumination, have eternal battery life. So you never need to change batteries in your remote control again. Here we see another example. This is a, a manufacturer, tech for home They have a different integration method. Here we see two different examples of remote control. You see very nice level of integration and also this eternal battery life. Let me show you two more examples. Osung is a Korean manufacturer of remote controls, one of the largest ones in the world. They are a manufacturer for LG, Google and others. This is a remote control that they launched last time at CES. So very nice level of integration this remote control is actually battery free. It has a hybrid super cap instead. And here at CES, they're launching a new remote control where the entire top surface of the remote control is a solar cell. So they have printed buttons. So when I press here, I can still, I get the tactile response. I can feel the buttons. And the entire surface is a solar cell. This is only possible with PowerPoint. No other solar cell technology in the world can accomplish something like this. This was actually the first product that we launched almost three years ago in the market. So it's a bicycle helmet with one of the most premium bicycle helmet manufacturers called POC. So there's one solar cell. It's completely integrated into the helmet. You see our brand here visible as well. And if I take my hand inside of the helmet, it thinks that I wear it and it turns on the light. This product doesn't have a charging port. It doesn't have an on and off button. So it's, it's an added security feature. You just wear the helmet like you normally do. You don't need to think about charging. You don't need to think about turning it on and off. So great example for what is possible with PowerFoil. And again, this would be impossible with any other solar cell technology. Another good example of a PowerFoil application. So this is a GPS tracker that's built into a dog harness. This one is selling in Sweden at the moment and it offers eternal battery life. So if you want to track your dog with a GPS tracker, you don't need to worry about charging anymore. 3M, they have a big part in our booth. They have staff here at the show the entire week. We are also present in the 3M booth. Another important customer of us is Urbanista. So they also have a section where you can try out the product, experience it in different light conditions. Let me give you a tour. Today we have three products on the market with Urbanista. 
we have an over-ear headphone, a true wireless headphone, and a wireless speaker. The over-ear headphone was launched over two years ago, has been selling really well. It has received great reviews from the largest tech, com tech um, magazines in the world, like TechCrunch and Gadget, Wired, and they all confirm that you don't need to charge the product. So Urbanista, they launched a true wireless version, earbuds, solar cell on the cover, and recently, six months ago, at IFA in Berlin, they launched this wireless speaker, where you have the solar cell integrated here. Again, this product has received fantastic reviews. It won 21 awards at IFA, and it's selling really well. So it's a good example of what you can do with PowerPoint. And actually, Urbanista just announced this week that they're launching updated versions of these two headphones with a smaller solar cell, but still the same performance. Here we also see one of the first products that we launched. This is a truck driver headset uh, from an American company called Trident. So when a truck driver is driving by law, one ear is covered and the other one is free so that you can hear the traffic. But there is a lot of light in the truck. So we capture this light and offer eternal battery life for this headset. Symphony is one of the world's largest audio manufacturers. They developed the speaker that they're showcasing here with us at CES. So this is a conference room speaker or a speaker that you can use in your home. You don't need to charge it. So if you look here closely, the, almost the entire top surface is a solar cell. So we have had a lot of the big CE companies here, a lot of big manufacturers, tech companies here at CES. It has been a really busy week and very successful. So introducing Powerfoil and explaining this new technology, of course, creates a lot of interest. But for us, the ecosystem of our partners is extremely important. So we cooperate with manufacturers in various verticals, and each one of them have learned how do you build products with PowerFoil. They have each specialized in different ways of integrating PowerFoil into a product. We also work with different tech companies. You see some examples of chipsets. So we like to cooperate with companies that focus on low power technology, new kind of storage solutions and different kind of low power technology that can realize even better performance. So here you see some of the examples of companies that we cooperate with. We also work with companies that help us and our customers to design in PowerFoil into products. And we work with strategic partners that can help our customers to realize higher volume or companies like ABB that can automate our factory. So let me give you some examples. So if we look at PowerFoil, our technology, so here on this table you see some examples of different textures. So we can texturize PowerFoil to look like basically any material. Brush steel, carbon, wood, leather. And we can do this texturizing without losing any power. And there are hundreds of standard textures to choose from, but if a customer wants a customized texture, like Adidas, they wanted their textile Adidas look, then we can customize the texture. And we can do this without losing power. If you try to do this with other solar cell technologies, you will lose power. Here on this table, we see some different examples of integration that we saw on the outside. Again, Here's another example of a remote control with a button underneath the solar cell. So you can press up to 250,000 times without anything happening to the cell. And you can also print logo types and text on top of the solar cell. So you see there is a black PowerFoil logo. That we can do without losing any power because it's actually printed with a transparent ink. The yellow part is this covers a small percentage of the cell, so if it covers 3%, you lose 3% of the power. But it looks really neat. Follow me. So we have 
two different versions of Powerful. One we call Powerful Indoor. This one we use in remote controls, price tags, sensors, products that are only used indoor. And then we have another version of Powerful we call Powerful Hybrid. This one we use in headphones, speakers, helmets, products that are used both indoor and outdoor. A couple of weeks ago we just announced 20% more performance for Powerful Indoor. So Powerful Indoor is now the world's best indoor solar cell. So the highest power output in the world. Here we see an example of a solar remote. I take off the lid, there's an amorphous silicon solar cell in glass. So if I put this remote control into this light measurement equipment here, measure the power and compare that with when it's integrated into the product, there is a 42% difference in power. So if you have a glass-based solar cell, you will lose a lot of power when the solar cell is integrated. And the reason for this is because, of course, the plastic cover steals some light and there is a distance in between the solar cell surface and the product surface. So light that comes from the side and is absorbed by the solar cell now, once it's integrated into a product, it's not. So, there is also another very important difference between Powerfoil and other solar cells, and that's partial shading. So, we always use one single cell which means if I cover part of the cell, the rest of the cell is still working. But if you have a traditional solar cell and you cover one of these series connected cells, you get zero output from the whole module. So this is called partial shading. And for many applications, you have light changing, part of the product might be covered or you might have stronger light on one side and the other then partial shading becomes really important. So this is not only, I mean, better looking, but it also has a huge impact on the performance. Today at Exeter, we have two production sites. Here we see Stockholm One, located in the city center of Stockholm. The three blue buildings there, that's our new factory. This is one of our print lines. So you see, every six seconds, we print one square meter and you can fit quite many solar cells into a square meter. And this is just with one production line, and we have many. So once fully ramped up, our factories will have a combined production capacity of two and a half million square meters. That's more than a billion remote controls or hundreds of millions of headband solar cells. So we will have one of Europe's largest solar cell, cell factories, all categories. And here we see a video on the background where we see part of our production. We are measuring and testing all cells that leave our production line. We are testing them, bending, twisting, thousands and tens of thousands of times. We measure the quality, the performance, the visual, everything about the solar cell. At Exeter, we take sustainability very seriously. As I already said, both of our factories are running on 100% renewable energy, but we're also completely toxic free. So our solar cell doesn't contain any toxic materials. They're of course recyclable, and we have a very low carbon footprint. So for both Powerful Indoor and Powerful Hybrid, we have a full LCA, and we are cooperating with customers and doing calculations on what impact does Powerful have on these various products. So let's take a look at some examples. So the 3M hearing protector that I showed you earlier, previously most of them were using non-rechargeable batteries. So switching to Powerful and a rechargeable battery will make a huge difference because the product will live approximately five years and during five years, you're gonna use a lot of disposable batteries, so which we now save. So the impact on the environment for this product is huge. Here we see another example. So the Adidas headphone that has now have been on the market for over two years. 
printed on their packaging material, you can see, powered by light. No charging cable included. And the reason is that the carbon footprint of our cell is so small, so it's equal to the carbon footprint of the cable. And another good point to point out that on all these products, so on the Adidas headphone, on the 3M hearing protector, on the Philips remote control, on the Urbanista headphones, on all the products that you will see here in our booth, you can see our brand visible on the product. Here's another product that we launched earlier this week here at CES. So this is a hearing aid from RCA. It's a brand that's owned by the company Vox. And you can see the solar cell is on top of the charging case. And you can see our brand clearly here on the product. This is a product we'll start selling later this year as well. And by the way, this one won a CES Innovation Award. We also see some other examples of products here that we have showcased earlier. Here we have an e-note that we made together with the market leader for reflective screens, e-ink. Again, you can see our brand here on the product. Here is the tracker that we have developed with some Japanese companies, uh, Semtech, NGK, Tachibana, and SoftBank. So this is a tracker that has eternal battery life that can track both indoor and outdoor. You will see our brand on all these products. So on the new Philips headphone, you can clearly see on the headband our product our logo. The Adidas headphone, same thing. You see the Adidas logo on one side and on top of the headband you see PowerPoint. Follow me and we take a look at the outside of our booth. On this wall you see some of the logos of companies that we work with. Some customers, tech partners, strategic partners and I've now showed you some of the new products that we launched here at CES. Some of the brands you might not recognize, like Arm for example. So we announced a cooperation, a partnership with Arm here at CES. I can't talk so much about what we're doing together, but more will come. Stay tuned. Another very important partner for us is a company called Kapsch from Austria. Uh, we have a strategic partnership together, an actually exclusive partnership. So when it comes to solar cell, CAPTCH only works with Exeter. And when it comes to road transponders, we only work with them. The product that we are developing together with CAPTCH will be launched later this year, so stay tuned. One of our most important customers is a company that until recently was called SES Imago Tag, and now it's called Vution Group. So it's a company from France that is market leader for electronic shelf labels. So the small price tags that you will see in Walmart stores, Ikea stores, Carrefour, or any other kind of store. Thank you for listening, and I wish you all a great 2024. Thank you.